India's aerospace major, the Hindustan Aeronautics Limited, is exploring a bold shift. It is turning its HJT-36 Sitara trainer into a light attack fighter aircraft. If this move materializes, it could make India a serious player in the global low-cost combat aircraft market where affordability and versatility are in high demand. So let's decode why this matters both for India's defense industry and for cost-conscious militaries around the world. The Hindustan Aeronautics Limited's HJT-36 Sitara was designed as an intermediate jet trainer for the Indian Air Force. Now, the HAL is evaluating this aircraft for a combat variant called Yashas. This it is doing by adding hardpoints, weapon systems and modern avionics. The modified Sitara or Yashas could carry rockets, bombs, gun pods and precision guided munitions. With its twin seat cockpit, it could double as a lead in fighter trainer, preparing pilots for frontline jets while also serving in combat. Across Africa, Latin America and Southeast Asia, militaries operate on tight budgets. Aircraft priced under 20 to 30 million US dollars are high in demand. Hindustan Aeronautics Limited hopes Yashas can compete with Super Tucano, Czech L-39NG and Korea's FA-50 in this segment. For India, this project could strengthen its role as an exporter of affordable air power. Success would add to the growing list of exports from Tejas jets and Dhruv helicopters to Brahmos missiles and now Yashas. The light attack Yashas could also serve India's own needs. It could perform border patrol, counter-insurgency and close air support, freeing up Rafals and Su-30 MKIs for more demanding strategic missions. The Yashas faces challenges. Engine thrust limitations, survivability in contested airspace and tough global certification standards. Past delays in the project also raise concern about HAL's timelines. HAL's vision of turning the HJT-36 Sitara into a light attack fighter aircraft reflects India's determination to innovate and if it is successful, it could create a niche for India in the global budget fighter market. <laughs>